Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how you can quickly organize and group apps together on your Android phone. Let's get straight into it. I'm on my phone looking at a page view of my apps. When you add a new app, it's automatically added to your home page. However, you may want to organize similar types of app into groups for ease of use in the future. This is straightforward to do, but can be a little bit awkward if you haven't tried to do it before. You'll see I have four video apps on this page. In order to group them together, I need to select and move one at a time. To select an app, I need to tap it and hold it. This means I'll touch the screen, but instead of lifting my finger, I'll leave it on the screen for a couple of seconds. You'll know you've selected an app successfully when additional options appear on screen as shown. I'm going to ignore those options, however, but I am going to move my finger slightly. You'll see the app now moves with my finger. To group the Disney app with the Netflix app, all I now need to do is move it over the Netflix app. You'll see a small border now appears around the Netflix app to indicate that I'm grouping this app with it. Once I see that border appear, if I now lift my finger, the Netflix and Disney apps are grouped together. Your phone is also automatically given that app group a name, TV. I'll show you how to change that later. So now I'm going to do exactly the same with the Paramount and Amazon Prime apps. I'll select one of the apps I want to group and move it over the other to choose it. And finally, I'll lift my finger from the screen to confirm that. Now one limitation when grouping apps is that you can't add groups of apps together. You'll see if I try to add my two new app groups together, my Android phone won't let me. This goes back to what I was saying at the start of this guide. If you want to group any apps together, you must move them one at a time. I'm going to tap once on the My Videos group to open it. To select any of these apps, just like before, I'll press and hold it. When a number of additional options appear, I'll then move it outside the box. Wait for the box to disappear and then add that to your original group just by moving over it and dropping the app into it. You'll notice this time, as there are more than two apps in the group, the app group pops up to allow you to drop it anywhere you want within the group. I'll just tap on the phone screen outside that box just to close it. As our remaining app is no longer in a group, it's now just shown as a single app. To finally add this to the group, as before, we just need to drag and drop that into the app group. I promised I'd show you how to change the name of the group. This is quick to do. I'll tap on the group once to open it. Once open, all I need to do is tap on the group name shown. That will then be selected, and I can overtype the existing name with my preferred name for the group. And finally, I can press the return key to confirm that. Your new app group name has then been updated. I hope you found this Woggle Guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please do consider giving this video a like or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.